Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to part 10 of Let's Play Super Mario 64, brought to you by MunchGames.ca. Obviously, I'm a fan of but you already knew that, so... Just who else has been playing this game on this channel? So we're going back to Cuckoo Mountain. Mm, yeah, let's go ahead. Uh, should we really do the 8 red coins? Something I want to test out first before the 8 red coins. And I just got my answer. Okay. That was kind of cool. Anyway, we're going to go get the 8 red coins. Might as well. I did say in the last video I was going to try to... F I'm assuming this is a... A free man, which I knew I was... Pretty much knew I was right. Now be careful here. We don't want to fall off the edge. And there's no life. And there's another coin. Ow! That... kinda hurt. But... How many we got now? Five. I'm trying to remember the rest of them are too now. Yeah, let's just go back this way. I like that. Boing! <laughs> that should be number six. I think number seven's over here. Now, where the hell is number eight? Because I can't remember now where that's to. Oh, there it is. It's in the tree. Oh, never mind then. Yeah, I know you lost a freaking baby. I already gave it to you.
Yeah, unfortunately the star is back up there. Like, really? You can actually do this. There we go. Okay, I don't know why you won't freaking long jump. Cause I'm pressing the, the button at the right time. There we go. Anyway, got it. Who cares? <laughs> Star 48. Frost is live. 48 red coins. Someone's lost his head, and this is the one that I like doing. That was kind of cool. Now we can do this right. Okay, apparently I didn't do it right. So you gotta do it at the right moment, apparently. So hold on a second, I'm gonna go try this off camera for a second. Okay, I, I got it now. You actually gotta have him follow you. That's what it is. Well, yes, I took the damage, but that's fine. Perfect, what a great new body. And he gives you a star. And that snowman's lost his head. Simple. Have him follow you. Now if you time it right, you can move out of the way and you won't get hit like I did. But, that's fine. Now, when I was a kid, I couldn't figure out, uh, at first, I couldn't figure out this one, wall kicks will work, I knew how to wall kick in that, just I didn't know where you had to do it. Now, of course, it didn't take me years later, I eventually found it out the very same day, because then I was like, hmm, there's a cannon, and I was like, what is this cannon for? And, I'm like, the cannon gotta have some kind of, no, wait, no, gotta go this way. Whoa. So it's not like my, I guess I don't totally hate Cool Cool Mountain, but it's not my particular favorite. Well, took, two, uh, took a little bit of damage, that's alright. Because we just go into the street, and my coin. 
And there we go. I actually gotta no, see the only problem with this is it is an enemy here. Oh, actually, there's two of them. So be very, very careful. Unfortunately, you can lose your, the coins that they would give you. You could just take enough damage there and get past them. <sighs> get a good run on, okay, ba ba ba. So it's just pretty much telling you. This is how you long jump. And now it's telling you that how to wall kick. See, that's how you walk it. Okay, I don't know why he doesn't like doing it. Oh, can you backflip up there? This question. I've always wondered that. Oh, you can backflip. Oh. Okay. Whoop. There's another sign here too. What's this one saying? Memory of truth. Okay, so. But you can just do. Wait. Yeah. You can just do this. For this part. Okay, hold on a sec. That's what I'm talking about. So yeah, you can just do that, and then run into the wall. Now what you gotta do here, is wall kick off the side here. Anyway, I'm gonna meet you up though. Okay, I'm back. I got up there on the very next try, but what happened is I had to take, uh, go do something else. Hmm, something wrong with the game. It's lagging a bit. Hold on a sec. Well, that's strange. I, mm, I had to close the emulator and turn it back on. And apparently, it fixed. And now we have 50. And cool, cool mountain is done. We still got one in the hazy maze. Okay, I know what one that is. And shifting sideline. Okay, so we're gonna go to Hazy Maze. I'll be right back. All right, now I uh, figured I'd meet you at uh, you know this stage. So now we're gonna do Metalhead Mario can move. Which is not a hard one, actually. You need to have the metal cap unlocked, obviously, because it's metal head, so... Self-explanatory. Once again, we must go down to where... Let's see, Stu. Yeah, fuck this. Oh, not wait. Yeah, ooh, half my life is gone. What do you know?
And this is it. And that's it. That's Metalhead Mario can move. That simple. And Hazy Maze is gone. With the exception of... You bet it. 100 coins. But, like I said, I'm going on a 100 coin mission eventually. For a couple of these uh, worlds. You also notice, at 50 stars, guess who's back? Mr. Rabbit's back. He comes back around 50 stars. He can't be a pain to get. But I'm actually going into Shifting Zanland. So, shining atop the pyramid. Uh, yeah, we'll do this one. I guess. Yeah, I'm expecting a snowstorm, actually. Uh, well, this is recorded on Wednesday, uh, Thursday the 19th, so... We actually are waiting for some kind of snowy weather in Newfoundland here, well, too, but... This video will probably be up a couple of days after that, but... You know, just to let people know... Oh! You bastard. Yeah, I hate that new fucking Shaga because I had this and then. He goes and fucking ruins it on me. Okay, that time it was my own fault, but still. I usually don't have that this much trouble getting this one. But apparently, I do this time. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna stop the video pretty much as soon as I get this star, anyway. Uh, at least that's my plan. Got it? Ah, there we go. That fucking shy guy. I'm gonna kill- I had to kill him. Getting in my way. Anyway, I'm gonna stop the video here, I guess, and then the next part, as soon as we start the video, we'll get messed up. Actually, yeah. Hold on a sec. I'm gonna change my mind on that. Yeah, got it. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, let's actually keep on going. I figured I was gonna stop the video, but it's not that long, and it's not even 20 minutes, so yeah. Let's get another to start too. Standing tall on the four pillars. Now, yeah, every now and then, I'm usually really good at this game, but you know, it's the LPS curse. That's what I'm chalking this up to, it's the LPS curse. Sometimes when I record Mario, or any game, I'm doing really damn well, and then other times, it's just, you know, a pain in the ass. Yeah, I tried this one before, remember, and I died. And it was the exact same fucking point that I died. For some reason, wing cap and that does not match. It's not a hard one to do either, it's just... 
pain in the ass. It says stand tall on four pillows, so I'm assuming. I'm assuming that's what you gotta do. And here we go. We actually got a boss fight now. Remember, we usually don't get a lot of those. With the exception of... Uh... Wilm's Fortress. Uh, Bomb Bomb Battlefield. Apparently this one. And well, the bullies. But, that's about it. This is like a Sonic boss. Who walk you? Who walk... Uh, apparently, we have to defeat these guys. Punch him in the eye. That's one hand out. Oh, that's a dick move. He pushed me right off. Okay, I'm gonna meet you back there. Okay, I'm back here, so let's finish these hands off once and for all, shall we? Usually, I usually get them on the first try, but apparently they want to be bitchy at me today. They all sound the same. Yeah, couldn't do that last time, could I? That will be his curse, I'm telling you right now. There we go. I think the next one's eight red points. But I'm gonna stop the video here anyway. Actually, I'm gonna catch that rabbit. Let's just see if I'm right if the next one's eight red coins. I'm pretty sure it is. Yep, it is. Okay. Anyway, let's catch a rabbit. And then I'm gonna stop the video on a note. I hate this rabbit sometimes. When I was uh, younger, I caught him like on the first. Oh, I always caught him like on the first try. But for some reason now, these days, I can't. Yeah, if you walk up close to him sometimes. You can get them. What's Toe got to say anyway? I oh, don't know. Nothing important. I've been hunting. I thought this was duck season.
Oh, I don't want to go into the level. Anyway, I'm going to catch him off camel. Okay, I got it. No, 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 not again. I'm in a great hurry, can't you? S okay, I'm going to let you go. But you're going to give me another damn star, you bastard. And we gotta cast six stuff. So anyway, I'm gonna stop the video right here. Wow, another power star. Get more power from the castle. Okay. Anyway, I shall see you all in part 11. Where we will actually... Hold on a sec. Before we stop... Grab it. You're coming with me. Uh, we have Bomb Bomb Battle Field done. So the only thing left now... On the first floor, besides I gotta unlock a new level called Dire Dire Docks. Spoiler alert there. Is I have to finish off Shifting Sandland and get all the 100 coins in each world. Except for Boo and... Bomb Bomb Battlefield. Because we had those done. So in the next video, we will finish Shifting Sandland. Then I might go on... Uh, plan on doing... Uh, 100 coins in a lot of the levels. There might be some editing in those levels, depending on, like, what's on the go. But most likely at that, I'll sh get the, uh, all 100 coins. If I don't do the 100 coins in the next video as part of Shifting Sandland, I might start with Die, Die, uh, start with Die, Die, Die. 